As the teams make their way into the stadium. Special occasion tonight in the Allianz Stadium. It's the 200th match uh, to be played here, and what a remarkable record Juventus have got, winning 158 of them, drawing 32. They've only lost nine times at home in this stadium, only five times in the league. Their win rate is nearly 80%. Quite extraordinary. They've lost only 4.6% of all the matches that they've played in their shiny new arena. The man in the middle there is Daniele Kifi. He was the fourth official for the derby at the Olimpico last weekend where Lazio beat Roma 3-0. His last visit here to Turin was for Juve's 2-1 win over Sassuolo. Both goals coming from Paolo Dybala and Dybala among those on the bench tonight. At career, 34 appearances, 19 goals. That shows what a player he is. He's seven years young now, looking to Spinazzola who has a, a first run at the defence. You can learn so much. Fable a little bit more. Mm, McTweedy trying to shield it. Challenged by it to Arvest. Just look at it like that and go for it. Over it comes and beaten away by Musso. And over the top it was Rugani up in the penalty area. Wasn't the most convincing from the goalkeeper, was it? No, he's just had a first call up for Argentina. And there's no pressure on him there. In challenge from Zegala. There's an urgency about Bernadeschi's play here. Oh, that was twinkle toed. Collected here by Bernadeschi. Got keen to his left, and it's a very comfortable gather for face here as well for Bentancourt. Sliding it in, and there on the turn, Matuidi was almost in. Well, the ball's a good one, pinged into him. I used to love those balls coming at that pace. Stays on side. It is for even the big sides to get anything. Some going, that is. Most recently in uh, September is one of those uh, earmarked to come in long term at the back as Alexandro sends it in. And Moise Keane is there and celebrates his first start of the season for Juventus in Syria with a goal inside 10 minutes. Well, there's one young gun who's out to prove a point. Couldn't be a better start for the young man. He backs himself, he gets in the right positions, he expects that quality to come in. He's not afraid to miss and he's not afraid to get in there. Build up again, not bad. Intercept. Here's uh, Spinazzola. Oh, he's away from Zegala here. Mm, a Tweedy fans, is it, doesn't he? Certainly does, in the thick of it once more as the ball comes back in and defensive responsibilities. In by Bernadeschi. That was again Matuidi getting deep inside. In the first leg anyway, long way to go in that one. This is Keane sending it over. It's Manchester United in the Champions League in the first week of November. Keane will sniff around and Demaya saw what was behind him. Whipped in again and it just flashes wide of the post. Quality of the ball and just made that possible. They just switch off a bit. It's, yeah, they're just sitting back in uh, the banks. Of Comfortably away. It's Alexandro feeding it through, collected by Federico Bernadeschi. Well, the only thing he did wrong there was try and put too much behind it. Didn't need to from where he was. His first touch was absolutely brilliant. Look at this. To do that and then look at him. He's off balance when he hits it. And he didn't need to be. Stick cup competitions, but he's given the ball away here, though, to Moyes Keane, which is not a good idea. Lovely tight control. Floated into the far edge of the six-yard box, and it was Emre Jan on the end of it. Well, again, the build-up is really good to watch. Wonderful first touch there, drives it in beautifully. And he was, he's blaming himself there, but he got a little nudge there. Not once, but twice. Gave him a delighted. My second game was Romania away in a World Cup. He has only lasted the first quarter of this match and has had to uh, go off already. So that's a good here now. 
Almost falling inside the penalty area to Ignacio Pusetto. He's booked him. Handball. Intentional handball by the look of it, wasn't it? Yeah, referee very quick with the... Stiga Larsen, a Danish international. Kassaris finding Emre Can. Spinazzola on the near side. Oh, it was rather decent for uh, Juventus. His second start, the number 37. Into the goal scorer, Moise Keane, a lovely piece of skill. Good to see him getting an opportunity, though, in the uh, black and white. Here's uh, Alexandro for uh, Juventus. It would only be beneficial for somebody as young as him. Bentancur sends it over. Needed something special. Spinazzola with a little nutmeg there on uh, Zegalaru. And long and met by the head of uh, Tristikon. Shot by Bernadeschi. Arbus being tested by Alexandro. The two of them uh, from half time. Only white, black and black and white shirts up for this one, but uh, no save required on this occasion. Head up. Russo's not had much to do, has he? No, he hasn't. You're quite right, Gary. Actually, as Moyes Keane sends it through in towards Matuidi. Towards Pusetto, who was several paces away from where the, the pass ended up, as now Keane wants that one, and it was time. Di Maio underneath it. Bernadeschi does. Di Maio. Amapoku is beaten by Moyes Keane. Keane taking it all the way into the box and all the way into the back of the net. An opportunist goal, if ever I've seen one. Moyes Keane with his second of the night. Juventus 2, Udinese 0. I'm not sure, but I think this gets a deflection. But it all came from all that decent possession Udinese had, but did nothing with. All looked pretty, but never threatening. The next minute, Juventus get the ball back, and they are threatening, and they, they get the opportunity, and they do that. Well, look at that. That's a decent header. Loses out, Spinazzola. Now Zegala. Worked the back four, but they haven't at all. Matuidi now for Juventus. It oh, yeah. sails over everyone's head. Seiko Fofana looks for the chance to shoot. And sends it fizzing beyond the goal. Goals coming up over the opening 45 minutes. Again, it's over the head of Keane, but only half cleared. Bernadeschi running by Alexandro. Cut out Keane with a little layoff. Bentancur. <laughs> half time whistle blown by Daniele Kifi. And Juventus have dominated the opening 45 minutes from start to finish. Moise Keane has been the star of the show, scoring both of the goals set up by Alec. Is the referee, as uh, Cristiano Ronaldo obliges a few spec. So here we go then with the second 45. Uh, Juvan, Matuidi again making the run into the penalty area, almost on the end of it, and Bernadeschi first time sending it well wide. But Keane and Matuidi both uh, got a bit of a knock there in challenging with Juan Musso. That was nasty. Referee uh, happy for the game to go on. Just back. No, he didn't. Collected by Keane. Little layoff finds Matweedy. Didn't. <laughs> Slid in by Joe. Tussling with Rugani. Gets the better of him. Rodrigo de Paul. Floating that one in. Hope of an hour battling away. Losing out to Emre Jan. Looking for Moise Keane once more. Away by. Musso and Alexandro, you could see what he was seeing. Here now is uh, Spinazzola, too long for Keane, again... Uh... This time, right, I'm just going to put it in an area. Keeper doesn't do particularly well again. Up against uh, Arvest. Now Alexandro sending it in. To uh, test uh, Szczesny in the Juventus goal. Bags of room here now for Alexandro to send it forward. And first time on the volley from... Leonardo Spinazzola. Have one thing in his mind. Yeah, look at the big smile on his face. That's it's worth a crack, though, isn't it? Yeah, why not? Yeah, certainly no Van Basten. A 
Ghani there just one loss to Arba sending it in straight into the gloves of Wojciech Szczesny. Sandro dispossessed in midfield. Bentancourt sends it forward. Keane is straining every sinew in pursuit of that. What a handful he is as he goes down. The challenge coming just, I think, inside the penalty area from a post. Napoli. And Chan makes it 3 0. What a cool penalty that was. Don't like those stuttery run ups. I can't believe they've not let Keane get his hat trick. I think that's really poor. Deserved it. He did all the hard work. He got the penalty. Let him take it. Let him have his moment of glory. Meanwhile, Emre Jan celebrates his fourth goal of the season. He scored two weeks running now. From uh, Bernardeschi over on the far side. And it comes. Between he's there. And he's got his goal. He's worked so hard tonight putting himself in the right place time and time again but Blaise Matuidi has scored for the first time in six months it's Juventus 4 Udinese nil he thoroughly deserves that and look at the enjoyment from the team